Cool, so today I have the Pegasus Turbo. Now, I've been wanting to review this shoe for a very, very long time. Um, but what stopped me? Price. And that's my only real issue with this entire shoe is the price point. 159.95 is really steep for a running shoe. Um, so that's what made me um and ah with it. But you know what, I bit a bullet. I eventually got it. Um, and I'm gonna have to tell you about why I love it. So starting with the upper, really nice breathable mesh going all the way through. And the entire shoe, it's slightly more uh, booty construction feel around the top, so the tongue is slightly sewn in, so it really gives that kind of lockdown through there. It's interesting because the lockdown is still there, even though they've moved the laces of the shoe slightly further back, so you've got a little bit more kind of breathability around the toe area, so no kind of restriction or anything like that. Dropping into the heel counter, like the Pegasus 35, nice little curvature just around the back of the Achilles to give it a little bit of space, no chafing or kind of irritation there. And then nice low through the ankles, so no irritation for the ankle bones or anything like that. Now dropping into the real awesome thing about this shoe is this midsole here. So this is Zoom X foam now. It's light, but super responsive and super kind of gives you so much energy back. It's a great feel underfoot and is kind of super light as well. So you get the responsive energy without feeling clumpy or anything like heavy on your foot. Um, for me, coming from kind of a Pegasus normal background, the newer Pegasus is a little bit softer. It's not like the old 34 that was a bit firmer. So the turbo really fits in that market and running in it just feels amazing. So dropping onto the outsole, you can see they're using these pentagonal kind of traction points through the front of the toe box here to help with that abrasion as you go to drive off the toes. But then through the middle here, we're actually using, do you remember Reacts? So using the React foam through the midsole here, one to help stabilize the Zoom X foam, but also just to give you again that kind of extra kind of abrasion really that absorption off the ground um, and you don't really need too much grip through the midsole here because you're either going to be striking through the heel rolling through that midfoot and then onto the forefoot so it's all about that transference of energy that kind of biomechanical make contact in the heel drive off and speed up off the forefoot so everything about this shoe is made for speed um, and that's why i really love it so kind of overall fit and feel like the pegasus 35 way better feel for me personally off of that forefoot so much more spring so much more responsiveness didn't really know i was really running in it which is what you want from a shoe you don't want to feel like it's effort to run and um, with the pegasus turbo that it's just an awesome feel i've only done about six seven miles on it so it's like one run but cannot wait to run more miles on it so yeah pegasus turbo tad expensive but i think it's worth the price point 